Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're doing some more debugging. We're going to catch usage of single and double quotes. JavaScript allows both uh, single and double quotes to declare strings. Deciding which one to use generally comes down to personal preference with some exceptions. Having two choices is great when a string has contradictions or other pieces of text that's in quotes. Just be careful that you don't close the string too early, which, syntax, which causes a syntax error. Here are some examples of mixing quotes. Um, so here they've got a double quote and then a single quote on the inside and a single quote here. So, okay, this is actually an example of why you want to use a double quote for a string like this. Um, and then here they've got a double quote with a single quote inside. This one works well too. This is incorrect. Why is this one? This one should be... Huh. This looks fine to me. Uh, Oh, I see. It says these are correct, these two are correct, and this one is incorrect. Um, and of course, it's okay to use one style of quotes. You can escape the quotes inside the string by using a backslash escape character. So here you have, uh, you've got single quotes to do the uh, string, but you can use this backslash key and your string will actually still come out well. Um, yeah, the, it's, it'd be useful to see this. If I were to put this string in here, and I would console.log, all, same, quotes. You'll see that this one, um, oh, I need to comment these out for now. This one comes out without the backslash in it. So we've got the I, I is in here, but we're actually using single quotes to wrap it. We just need to use this um, backslash or forward slash key to escape those. Anyways, I'm going to get rid of that for now and uncomment these guys. So we want to fix the string so it either uses different quotes from the href value um, so, in, so this one right now it's got a string. I'm just going to straighten this out so it's easier to see. This is a single string. And inside of this string we've got a pair of double quotes as well, which means that we have a string and then this is just a syntax error in here. And so this is just error. Here we're getting a syntax error. Here it's showing you exactly where it happens as well in the, um, in the readout. So one way that we could solve this is to just make these single quotes. And this would give us uh, the right answer. Um, another way that we could solve this is instead of making them single quotes, we could um, uh, oh forward slash out. And this would still give us the correct answer. Um, and then another way we could solve this is we could keep these at double quotes without uh, escape keys and just change these to single quotes. And then we'll get the, the right answer as well. Uh, your code should fix the quotes around the href value by either changing or escaping them. Hmm. Interesting. I think that this guy should work, though. Yeah, this one does work, but it's just not answering the right... Uh, it's not passing the tests on free code camp. But anyways, if we leave the escaped ones in there, we, we can pass the tests. Anyways, I hope this uh, helps you guys, and I'll see you in the next lesson.